So, we are back on the island. Now, I don't know how long we were on the ocean for, but I do know if we'd have stayed out there any longer, we'd be dead by now. And I can't let that happen. We need to find our sun. Now, as you guys can see, I've got a very small camp. I'm using this tent and this campfire just to keep me going for now. And I've had a lot of time to think. Now, if I'm to find Timmy in this place, I need to make sure I can keep the cannibals at bay, or whatever you want to call them, the tribe, the cannibals, the monsters of this island. I need to make sure I can outsmart them in this place. So I've been playing around with a few ideas for traps. But before I show you guys what I've been playing around with, I need to tell you what I heard last night. Now every single night since I've been back, I've made sure I've got a stockpile of food, water, and I make sure that I cover my tracks. Now, while it was pretty much pitch black, I could have swore I heard someone shout help. Now, I know that wasn't Timmy that shouted it, so that tells me there could be survivors in this place. And if that's the case, we need to find them. So I've got this crazy idea, guys. We need to travel back to the plane crash and hopefully find some kind of flight manifest, which will give us some kind of indication of who was on that plane when it went down. So that's what we're going to do. So let's take a look at this thing first. This is just something small that I've been playing around with, just so I don't have to carry any unnecessary loads while I'm going through the forest looking for food, or maybe looking for signs for Timmy, I don't know. But this is just something that I came up with. So this is an arrow basket. So let's see how many arrows it can hold. I hope this can hold everything that I have. It can. So at least we don't need to lug around the arrows now, and that frees up a little more space just in case we find anything while we're journeying around the forest. So let's take a look at the traps that I've made. Now this is a new one. This is the Molotov trap. It's pretty similar to the explosive trap where you place the C4 down with the tripwire, but I'm guessing this is going to be so much more nasty to the cannibals. And as you can see, I've placed it behind a couple of bushes just so they don't see it straight off the bat when they come off the ridge there. So hopefully that will be a nasty surprise for them. And it's pretty simple to make. It's just one Molotov bottle with a rope. And I, I, I guess that's called a trigger twig. A trigger? I can't speak English today. A trigger twig? I don't really know the name for it, but I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Now, the next thing I've been playing around with is this. And I still haven't finished it. So let's go ahead and do it now. I think I have everything that I need. So let me pick this up. Place this on here. I think it, it needs six. Okay. So I've got just the right amount of logs to build this thing, which is good because I didn't actually plan for this. So that should be all the logs, and it needs 10 stone. Okay, so let me pick all these up. How many can I actually hold? So let me throw this down on here. Oh, you can see that thing building up now. Good, okay, my plan is working, guys. Let me pick all these up. We should have enough. So there we go. And this thing looks brutal. Look at it, if the cannibals come across this thing and they set that wire off, oh, they are gonna have such a bad day. Can we actually test it on ourselves? I think, I don't think this should kill me, but I don't know, guys. So this is the trigger mechanism and it's getting super dark. So I need to do this quick. If I'm gonna get to the plane, I can't waste any daylight. So here we go, guys, moment of truth. <gasps> oh, holy shit. That thing is going to cause some serious damage. If I can set a few of these things up, if we build a new home, and we manage to find any survivors, I'm pretty sure I can keep them at bay with this. But I'm going to keep experimenting with traps, guys, and I'm going to keep up coming with ideas so I can keep them away. Can I reset this? Okay, good. I mean, I know it's not in the best place. This was just an experiment just to make sure this thing worked, but it's so cool. And it's definitely going to do the job against those guys. Okay, so we need to find the plane. Because if I'm to find any other survivors, I need to find that flight manifest. And we really don't have a lot of sunlight left. I'm going to hug the coast so I can stay away from the, uh, the thick, dense forest. And hopefully not get any nasty surprises from the cannibals. But I just hope there are survivors on this island. I always thought, as long as we've been here... I always thought we were alone, but I definitely heard the cry of someone in the distance last night. And I don't know why I didn't go out and look, probably because it was night time. But if there is anyone here, 
I can definitely help them and I can definitely survive for a longer period and hopefully they will help me find my son. Okay, so that looks like a cannibal outpost over there. Okay, we're running really low on daylight, guys. We need to go this way, I think, if this is right. It's been such a long time since I've been back. This should take me across Goose Lake. Molotov there, just in case I need it. I'm not going to crack open any cases. I'm going to come back for those later on. Oh, the fog's setting in. Oh, it's been such a long time since I've been back. It's a weird feeling. It's almost like I'm excited to be back. But at the same time, I'm still terrified. So I'm going to push on, hopefully find the plane, and find this flight manifest. Okay, guys, so... The good news is, I think I found the back of the plane. The bad news is, I'm definitely being hunted by the cannibals. This has taken me so long to find this. I mean, I think it's been a full daytime through to nighttime back to daytime cycle again. That's how long it's taken me to find this thing. But the good news is, I don't know if you guys can see that straight through the tree line. That, that small hint of blue. I think that's the tail end of the plane. But again... There's definitely cannibals in the area, and I think this is so close to a cannibal camp that I'm going to be in super, super danger right now. So I'm not going to rush this. I'm going to take my time moving up. When I last saw a cannibal, it was over in that direction. I haven't been checking the trees. Okay, let's just go. Hopefully there's going to be a manifest on this thing so we can see who was on the plane. I'm trying to listen out as well. The worst scenario right now would be to bump into something like Virginia or Armsy right now because I have nothing in the way of armor and I have no weapons because of when I left with the raft. Okay, I think that's just the plane. Yep, this is super close to a cannibal camp. I couldn't quite make that out, but that's definitely a hut over there. I just don't know which side of the map I'm on. I've really lost track of this place. Okay, let's just get this done. Can we get back inside? Okay, guys, here we go. Let's go. Get in. No, get in. Get in. Shit. Okay, this is going to be a lot harder than I thought, guys. I thought we'd just be able to jump back inside this thing. I'm going to give it one more go. If I can't get back inside, I'm going to have to make a platform. Okay, here we go. Oh, get in. Oh, there's just no way in that thing. Shit, I'm stuck. Okay, I'm going to die if I keep doing this. Okay, let me think, let me think. If I open this, what can I make real quick? Is there nothing that I can make? What about the stairs? If I can throw some stairs into it? Simple stairs. Maybe this? Okay, five logs. Okay, I'm going to track back. I'm going to build these stairs up, guys, because this is going to take me a while. I don't want to alert the cannibals, so I'm going to move further down that way, bring the logs back up, and then hopefully find this thing. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so here we go. Last log. Let's just build this thing and get the hell out of this place. Okay, let's get up. Why can't I get up? There we go. And get in. Okay, we're in. The last thing I need right now is a bunch of cannibals bottlenecking me into this plane. Okay, let's look around, see if we can see it. Now, I did check the front of the plane to see if the manifest was there with the pilots, but there was absolutely nothing. <gasps> there it is. That's the manifest. Okay, let me pick these up. I need some food. Okay. Do we have it? I don't know if I picked it up. Oh, I'm panicking so bad. Okay. What we do? Okay, so we can see. 